Los Alamos, New Mexico is where the atomic bomb was invented. Today, a wildfire is burning near the national lab there, where over the years a great deal of radioactive waste has been stored. We asked Cynthia Bowers to look into the hazards. With fire burning just a few miles away, Los Alamos National Laboratory scientist Terry Wallace pointed out Area G. It's there 10,000 55-gallon drums filled with low-level radioactive waste are stored. The bulk of the drums there truly are things like notes that are contaminated, gloves. Those drums are housed outdoors in domes made of reinforced steel covered with a plasticized fire retardant fabric. But lab officials insist this site and two others containing additional radioactive materials are safe. More radioactive waste is stored in concrete tubes buried deep in the ground. Plutonium and uranium are stored in vaults inside hardened concrete buildings. Air quality tests over the sprawling facility show no traces of radiation, but critics say no one really knows what would happen if Area G caught fire. Los Alamos Operations Director Carl Beard refuses to even acknowledge a worst-case scenario involving radiation release. I do not believe that there is any specific danger to the public from our activities at Los Alamos. The danger is from that fire on the mountain. And people who okay. live in the nearby town of Los Alamos, like Denise Lane, stand by the lab. Those people who work there, they live next door to me. They're my neighbors. They're my friends. I know who they are. Firefighters appear to be catching a break. The winds died down yesterday and they are blowing hard again today, Scott, but they're actually taking the fire away from Los Alamos. Thank you, Cynthia.